Greetings and salutations, everyone, and welcome back to Let's... Well, not back. I mean, that would actually imply that we've done this before. This is actually the first time. Welcome to the Evil Within. I'm Kamchak Fisco. Come join me for the next stop on this tale. All right, I'm gonna risk it. So much. For oh, stuff. come on! That's bullshit! Immediately the second I do that, he turns around. I call shenanigans. That was crap. Hey, asshole. I actually got to exploit that. I was standing, ducked, and then in stealth killed him. I'll take that, because fuck you. <laughs> that was... Oh, uh, that was fair. That was fair. After what he did to me over there, that was fair. Me being able to exploit that and kill his ass. That was totally fair. Alright, so I think we got everything from the truck. Can I lure them over with that? The detection parameter is 270 degrees. That's a little excessive. It's like some uber awareness shit, because humans don't have that. You have a, what, 130 degree visibility arc as a human being? Oh, okay, there's nothing else in the truck. 180. No, we don't have 180, because the sides of our head block it. It's not a full 180. It's probably 170, because I know it was, it was like 10 degrees off, so it's probably 170. But yeah, we do, we do have a fair amount. Hanging bullets. Yeah, that's her. And we need to go back and tell him about the operatives that went rogue, don't we? Because he like wanted us to find out. Or do we have to go kill them and take their shit first? <laughs> Y'all just saw that, right? I slid over to the parking lot, slid back, and took the bullets. That was, um, interesting. I'll go with interesting. The fuck? We're finally totally in the green, so if you guys feel you can find a right moment to pause and unpause to catch up, go for it. Because it does look like you guys are still about 10 seconds behind. Goodbye. What was the glitch you had, Any? <clears throat> Whoa! What did... Ow! Can you heal today, please? That would be swell. Okay, if they have a Molotov, just shoot the fucking Molotov. Good to know. I thought he only had a torch. And I don't mean flashlight, I mean legit torch. I want to get the asshole by the car first, because there's far less cover here. You still have a clip about it. I will have to watch that, dude. Because it sounds like you ran into the ridiculous. I'm probably going to get spotted, but I'm going to try anyway. God damn it, I knew it. Climb the damn... Oh, now you won't climb the... There we go. Can I do a drop kill? Because that'd be awesome. Come on, shitbag, over here. We got some shorter bushes. Come on. Come on. Come on, asshat. Over here. Into the short bushes. You, really? You guys lose interest way too easily. Like, way too easily. This is like next level ADHD here. <laughs> this is... You gotta find me first, asshole. Oh, 
Come on, buddy. Come on. That was annoying. Okay, I'll wait and watch it later then. If it's late game, yeah, I don't want to risk spoilers. And I just got to get up on this asshole and I can finally look around the area peacefully. Oh, shit. Well, this is the dude with the hatches. So we get a melee weapon at least. Bye bye. I don't even remember if I. I'm pretty sure I don't. We died, so I'm pretty sure we lost our melee weapon. I hate that the melee weapon doesn't save. That actually sucks. Okay, well, that's clear. Now I can actually check the damn card. Makes sense. I mean, if you had to clip it yourself, yeah. Is there anything else over here? I don't think so, but I'm not sure. Some of these look like doors you'd actually be able to go into. Okay, now we can't squeeze down the alley. Trash can! Give me some loot! I want my junk! Oh, I actually found something. Uh, somebody threw away gunpowder. Yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> sure, why not? I mean, we're not in reality. Things don't need to make sense. Alright, so what do we... We've already gone all the way there. We can actually start moving over there and making our way back and forth, crisscrossing like I wanted to. But I want to see if we can talk to Senior Numbnuts about his friend. Rogue Signal. Okay, so that's one of them. And that's actually the area of where I was going to head to next. So that works per Wait a minute. We were already in that building. Plus, I can also use the shock bolt to get through the one door back in the armory, so I kind of want to go explore. Alright, we'll tell him in a minute, after we've dealt with at least one of the rogues. Yeah, I was in this building. Yeah, I was totally in this building. What the hell? Who to what now? Oh, because we're right on top of the signal. Yeah, that actually makes sense. Chances are he's not still here, but we'll at least get an update on where the hell he went. Was there anything over here? I don't even remember. Oh, I never actually checked the kitchen here, because we had gotten distracted. Really? 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 I'm, I'm going to go with bullshit. <laughs> That's obviously a scripted scene. And the second you get close to the door, boot. Okay, I only got the five bullets. Oh, yeah. I died. I never rebound that. Uh, put you on four. Well, no, I want to put you on five. Because the sniper would actually be four. Because the magnum would be... Three. Although I'll probably swap the Magnum and the Pistol just to keep them close together. So he's going back in while she's looking around. Alright, so you go away, then when she loses interest, I can go sneak up and kick her ass. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. There you go. And I should be able to stealthy open the door if I don't get there in time. Alright, she went back through. Cool, I did it in time for the door to still be considered open. So they're guarding the room that I wanted to go to anyway. Oh, come on! That should have been... She was still not alerted. I should have been able to hit her. Well, where was my fucking checkpoint now? If it's back at the damn crossbow, I'm going to be livid. Are you kidding me? That's fucking stupid. We hit no checkpoint that entire time? 
Oh my god, this is dumb. Well, I'll be cutting this bullshit out of the video for YouTube, because this is just stupid. Oops, didn't mean to hit that key. Come on, bitch. This is gonna be fucking stupid. So I'm gonna try to get it timed up so I can do it again, because I'm not gonna waste a goddamn heal on this bullshit. Not happening. Not happening. I'm not wasting a heal on this bullshit. Fuck that. The game screwed me by taking me this far fucking back. If I don't let it get in the goddamn house while we were there. This is just stupid. Made it through all this shit and a big ol' fuck you for it. Come on, asshole. Over here. Come on, stupid. Fucking hell. <sighs> yeah, if I went through that much shit, it should be fucking saving. It... <sighs> Don't trust the fucking checkpoint system. Good to know. Come on, asshole. Over here. Come on, dick. Climb up. I'll take it. Fuck you. I is not a happy Fisco. Because that's fucking stupid. Is there even a fucking save? There's not even a fucking save mechanic. I literally have to go back to base for this. That's kind of stupid. That's really kind of fucking dumb. That is a, hey, we're going to waste your time just to be ridiculous. I already knew about that. Why are you... Okay. I guess when I died, it resets everything I had pinged. Wow, when you die, it, like, fucks a ton of shit you have set up. That's really stupid. And it was stuff I did before I even got the crossbow. I'm going to immediately run, but it's not going to matter, because I'm going to take the fucking damage no matter what. Wow. Glad to see some, not the same, but there are some dumbass mechanics in this one, too. And he was right. He said there's going to be shit in here that's going to bug me. He was right. He was absolutely right. Just, they, they just traded stupid shit from one for stupid shit for another. But, you know, to be fair, that's a lot of video games. That's a lot of video games. Sequels fix one thing, break the next thing. Bound to be stuff in here that would bug the hell out of me. Wait, are they both on me? Yes, no, can't tell. Was that his? Yeah, I think it's both of them were on me. So him screaming triggered the other one. Okay. Alright, I just need to get over to the van. Come on, stupid. Go investigate. Good boy, dumbass. Gonna fucking risk it, cause no. Just just no, just all the no's. Okay, let's kill this motherfucker for the God, I don't even know how many times now. And then I'm gonna go back to base, so it'll fucking save, and then we can move forward. That is dumb. That is so dumb. Alright, where are you, ass casserole? Problem is, this douche goes back and forth. Can I climb the fucking truck? Thank you. Well, 
Come on, dude. Be stupid and do what I want you to do. Come on. Come on. Now, he should go back to his patrol or he's just walking back and forth to the truck. So I just need to go around the side, wait till he finishes coming over here, and then goes back. Then I can just get up behind him on his reverse roll and stab him in the back of the fucking head. I'm surprised he only went that far. I was expecting him to go further, honestly. Yeah, fuck you. Just all the fuck yous. Give me that, you dick. <sighs> Don't have enough to up upgrade the one thing I want to upgrade, so that's fine. I'll wait, but I gotta go back to the save so we can actually save. Do not trust the checkpoints in this game. Lesson learned. I love great games, but bad mechanics are just stupid. They're always stupid at the end of the day. Bad mechanics are bad mechanics, and they shouldn't be there. It's that simple. Well, at least they sped up the mirror sequence in this one. That's cool. Meow. Let's see, can I craft anything while I'm here? At least make this feel somewhat fucking useful. Oh, we can actually make medical... Well, yeah, we can make medical kits. Okay. I think so. It's red, which implies either we're at max or it implies that we don't know the recipe for it yet. I'll go ahead and make one of these because I'm pretty damn sure that the fuse won't be used for anything else. All right, so we got two of those... And we just use a pipe to make the harpoon bolts, but I'll hold off. Um, I still can't make myself craft ammo yet. I, I feel like we should wait. I feel like we should wait. What can I do with you? Charge time, fire range, damage for the harpoon bolts. Does this equal... Uh, it's flaming. I, I said EX. I thought maybe that meant explosive, but it did not. Alright. But flaming is already stupid powerful, we know that. Uh, effect chains to more enemies over a greater distance to three. Unlocks tier two for all bolts. Oh, it's for all bolts. Cool. Chain to four enemies. Do more damage. You can hit four enemies and it can do more damage. Uh, let's hold off. I wanted to do this because it wasn't stupid expensive and it is one extra bullet. That's a hundred. I appreciate it, Valiant. I really do. Uh, we can do the reload time. Okay. The aiming speed is what I really need to focus on. Because that being able to move fast while shooting would be nice. Alright, so that's 30, but I'm not, I don't really care. 90 for that one. I can upgrade the shotgun to hold more, but we don't have any more shells, so it's moot. Real time on the shotgun leads to that, but once again, moot, because I can't do anything with it. Uh, I think I might actually upgrade the harpoon. Nope, we're five shy, so it doesn't matter. Charge time on the bolt would be nice, because we, we could actually, you know... But bolt, literally, the, the, the crossbow is conditional weapon. It always was. Probably do that, but not right now. Alright, so that's it for the crafting. Alright, so let's save. And obviously we're not leveling up until we have 8,000, so that's fine. Yeah, I foresee myself doing a lot of farming off camera. I really do. Just going back and forth, killing the same enemies that keep respawning over and over again. Alright, let's see if the coffee's ready. So I can certainly use some fucking health. I should have done that before I saved, but eh, no biggie. All right, is the coffee ready? The coffee's ready, so we'll drink some coffee, get our health back, talk to this guy. Then we'll go investigate. I don't know if he'll care until we finish the investigating, but he said to keep him updated, so I'm going to keep him updated. Hey, what's up? Nope, okay. Until we finished with each one of them individually, it won't matter. Is there even a reason to go out this door? I thought that reality, like, fell off.
Does this even go anywhere? Is there even anything in here anymore? Yeah, I can't even go out the door because that section of reality fell. That's what I thought. It's kind of weird that it even lets us go back. I mean, it's part of the whole little mini open world shit they've done here, but still, it's a little strange. Considering how pedantic they've been about where we can go and where we can't, I'm genuinely surprised they let us. I really am. Yep, it always turns the light off when we go through that door. Even if the light is off before you go through the door. That's what I thought. We searched that house, right? I think we did. I'm gonna double check really quick. Yeah, we did, we did, we did. Okay. Alright, so I need to get back over here and kill these two assholes that are in this building that got me killed last time. That's a bottle. We also need to start expanding our search grid anyway. Yeah, I know. This is the house. I'm aware of that. So it at least gets... It changes the color from green to yellow to orange to red as you get closer. So that's actually useful. I'm not going to go over there and trigger her just yet. Because I want to see if there's anything over here. I don't know if this even counts as a hiding bush. Alright, we're probably going to give it scene, but I'm going to risk it. Usually when they stop like this, is right before they turn the fuck around. Yeah, quit thrashing, bitch. We're done. Uh, Why does that lady have a face on her, on her back? I noticed that when we stabbed her. Was that why we stabbed the side? Because we're stabbing the face? I mean, that would at least give it a purpose. Am I not going to any of these? Oh, great. It's another one of Edward Scissorhands' wives. Lovely. I wasn't trying to, but I think my character does automatically. Pretty sure my character automatically goes for the eyes. Minsk and Boo aren't around to see it. They'd be proud of us. Yep, I'm at stealth kill that bitch twice. Like a real cop. Yeah. Real cops go for the eyes. Not in Mesa. In Mesa, they shoot you in the ass. <laughs> I mean, at least it's not a fatal shot, but, I mean, wow. They, they shoot you in the ass. Not even kidding, either. There, there was a whole headline about it. It was hilarious. Well, it wasn't hilarious for the criminal, but still, it was just like, what the fuck, man? I don't need a hand, but, um... Okay. Can I disarm these? Can I... I can't disarm traps in this one? Okay. That's kind of weird. I'll just top down, thank you. It's faster. Um, it said I could use the knife to bust these open, so how does? Do I have to hop over? Oh, okay, here we go. Cop goes for the core. Yeah, it says some... Wow, that's a hell of a knife! That, that's, that's some adamantium right there. Uh, how long ago, Stumpy? Is this a scope? Mysterious weapon replica. That's the Doom rocket launcher. Or Quake. No, that's the Quake rocket launcher. I The sound when I picked it up is the sound of when you pick up quad damage in Quake 1. You feel like you've seen this before, but you can't quite put your finger on when or where it was. But at any rate, it looks pretty cool. You just have to keep it in your room. That's a that yeah that's 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 part of the quake rocket launcher that mm-hmm 
Okay. So that's the thing, apparently. We get to build the rocket launcher. I'm assuming that's one of the Easter egg slash unlock weapons that you'd get by completing the playthrough and having found all the goodies. Alright, I'm going to go by the front of this, because I think it's far enough away from where I can get away with walking. What is the fucking deal with the trap? I can't disarm it? Am I at the wrong angle or something? Or, Annie, can we disarm traps in this? Because it didn't look like it would let me. And I can't get up over to whatever hell's on this side without it. Wait, am I at the other dude? File number 15. Interview with Detective Sebastian Castellanos. Excuse me? Detective, could you please tell me about that day at Beacon Mental Hospital? I told you ten times already. Let's go through it one more time. More like an interrogation than an interview. Please, detective. Mm-hmm. <laughs> am I close to the girl's voice? Because if I am, I want to back off. I don't want to trigger that yet. And I'm going to guess no justification for what they've done. Okay, that just allows me to go in and out of there, but I could have just hopped the fence and gone around, so I don't see what the point... Yeah, I know. The, very rarely is there an actual legitimate justification, but still, it's just like... At the very least, if they're going to do something that fucked up, you, you would hope there was an excuse. Valid or not, just something. A reason. Okay, the car's not this. Or the, the signal. The girl's not this. Why does this look like I should shoot it and light it on fire? It really does. Are you dead, dead? I didn't think so. Oh, I don't have to be ducking for a stealth kill. Nice. I didn't know that. Very cool. And you just have to be behind him for a stealth kill. You don't actually have to be sneaking. Nice. That is very fucking useful to know. Especially after all the bullshit. This is going to be Molotov. This is going to suck. That somehow didn't hit me at all. I'll take it. I'll take it. Screw that. I'll take it. Give me the goop. I'll deal with the rest of the assholes later. I was just trying to skirt around to see what was over here and then make my way back to the building. Alright, if he's going to spring up, I need to go around. Do I have to unlock the curb stomp ability? It just, with, the, with the way he's killing him, this feels more like the walking dead than anything else. It's just, it's, it's weird. I love how they just spring to life when you get close enough. Fingers crossed to the Molotov. Nope, not this time. We didn't get lucky. Okay. Okay, this is the house where this is coming from. This seems like important. I like don't want to trigger this. I feel like I want to wait and come back later. Is this trash in the yard? It's hard to tell. Okay, she's over there. There's like a dead one more dead dude over here in the street. My personal thanks to each and every one of you for tuning in. You all are awesome viewers. Really appreciate you taking the time to watch this video. It means a lot to me, and I do hope you enjoy it. You all take care of yourselves. If you want to see more of me, keep up the video on the list, or stay tuned for more. Feel free to leave a comment below, and please remember to take that like button if you enjoyed the video. In the meantime, fare thee well, everyone.